Well, thank you very much, everybody. Uh, the folks behind me got us right over the top from North Dakota. So North Dakota made a big statement, and I just really appreciate it. We will not forget it. Thank you very much. That's good. Is that right? That's good. I love that word. He used the bad word because he knows nothing about business. When you rattle someone, that's good, because many of the world, as you know, many of our — the countries in our world, a beautiful world, have been absolutely abusing us and taking advantage of us. So if they're rattled in a friendly way — we're going to have great relationships with these countries — but if they're rattled in a friendly way, that's a good thing, John, not a bad thing. We were supposed to be going into July, and the, a lot of people said it wouldn't even be solved during that convention. There's going to be a new convention in August. And here I am watching Hillary fight, and she can't close the deal. And that should be such an easy deal to close. But she's unable to close the deal. So I'm watching her, and we'll see what happens. The beginning, right? I was say, say, say. Well, you've changed my life. Who, Pocahontas? <laughs> Pocahontas? Well, no, she's... Look, look, she is — she is it offensive? You tell me. Oh, oh, really? Oh, I'm sorry about that. Uh, Pocahontas? Is that what you said? Elizabeth — Elizabeth Warren? She is — no, no, she tweets a lot about me. Every once in a while, I'll tweet. And when I tweet, you know, not that many people are watching her tweets. When I tweet, they watch. I will say this. Look, uh, she is a senator that's highly overrated. She's passed very little legislation. She has been a — real disaster for a lot of people, including the Democrats, who, frankly, can't stand her, many of the Democrats. Just ask Hillary Clinton how she likes her. And I would say this — I'll debate anybody. I don't care. I'd debate her. Uh, but she's done very little for Massachusetts. And the beautiful thing is, when I won Massachusetts, with many people running against me, I got up to almost 50 percent. And she was fighting me. So I, I really think if her record was exposed, and the fact that she was a Native American — she said she was Native American, but she wasn't able to document it. She said, well, I have high cheekbones. You see? I have high cheekbones, so I'm a Native American. And she then — I don't know if you'd call it a fraud or not — but she was able to get into various schools because of the fact she applied as a Native American and probably able to get other things. I think she's as Native American as I am, okay? That I will tell you. Everybody.